up i hope you're having a great weekend it is saturday now usually i put up a video every friday but yesterday i did my giveaway video well i announced the winner to my giveaway so i did that instead on friday so here i am on saturday at i don't even know what time it is but here i am at, to give you a new video so let's get started all right so today's video is going to be about physicians formula rosé all day times exterior glam collection this was given to me by influencer so that it was a complimentary product that was given to me so i could do an honest review on it so firstly what is influencer so the last time i did a video i did use a product that i received from In influencer in it but i gave like a brief overview of what it is so basically what it is is an app that you can give reviews on products that you have you can ask questions about different products or let's say you want to buy something you want to ask a question about it before you buy it you can create your own poll so people can vote on it very cool um, it's a cool app and as you do more of it and get more reviews and get more likes and you can even put photos of like um, products that you use and what happens is after a while I was very impatient with this but after a while they do send you what is called snaps and snaps is broken up into each category so they have clothing food makeup travel fitness and all that different stuff and you just basically answer a bunch of questions in it and you say like what products have you used and related to the, that category and then you can do a review on it you don't have to if you don't want to but the more you do the more box boxes and complimentary products that you will get so what is a box box so basically a box box is given by influencer with products that they want you to review it is free you don't pay for anything they send it to you and then all you have to do is review it on wherever they want you to review it so they give you different steps so you have to either review it on Ulta Beauty, Sephora influencer whatever um it wants you to review it and you have to show proof that you reviewed it so after you do that then you complete that and then you get your then you get a badge and you get different badges for different things so you could get that badges for if a lot of people liked your comments i mean if a lot of people liked your reviews if um you do a lot of reviews um and just different um different badges based on um different categories also now you want to make sure that you do snaps that relate to what your content is about. So specifically for me, I do a lot of snaps that are related to makeup and beauty products and skincare stuff because that's um, what my content is about. So I wouldn't do snaps on food because I don't want any like food products that I have to review because that's not what my content is about. That's not what I make videos about. So you want to make sure that you do snaps so that you can get box boxes that relates to oh sorry i don't know what happened spit just came out of my mouth um that you get box boxes that interest you and you would like to do reviews on so what else what am i missing um in addition to box boxes sometimes you will also get um snaps or campaigns that you have to buy and then they do reimburse you so it's still Com complimentary so you still get your money back for it um uh, let me rewind so campaigns are basically like after you do your snaps influencer will email you saying oh hey you're great for this campaign so a campaign is basically where you get the box box so you answer a survey and then they may pick you to do the campaign and if they pick you then you get a box box or you get a product that you have to review and each campaign they do give you a, a time limit so it could be a month or two weeks depending on the campaign you have um, that amount of time to complete all the steps so I recommend it it's really cool it does take a while at first but uh, if you keep up with it and do reviews and post photos and just and also like follow people and like people's stuff 
Like if you keep on with it, then you you will get a Vox box. It took me maybe a month or so to get my first Vox box. So I definitely recommend it. So I will definitely put the link below. And if you have any questions, don't um, be afraid to reach out to me. All right. So that's influencer. So let's get into the product. All right. Like I said, so for my campaign, I received the Physicians Formula Rosé All Day Times Exterior Glam Collection. So let me show you what's in it. So this is what it looks like. So we have a perfume, a little mini perfume. We have lip color. I, get, I think it's a pencil. I'm not sure. I didn't open it, as you can see. And then you have four different eyeshadows. So this is Teodua. It's like a blush pink. This is Poppin', um, Champagne, and Rich. And then they, it also comes with blush and highlighter. So I'm just going to use it to create a look. I'm Honestly, I'm going to try to create this look and see how it comes out. So let's just see how it is. Okay, so first, I'm going to start off using the Poppin' Everescent eyeshadow um so far I do like the color of this eyeshadow this is the like I said this is the poppin and I think, yep, this is the poppin'. And I do like how dark it is. I love dark colors. So I, I'm definitely feeling this color. So now I'm going to go in with the Taya Dua. This is going to go on top. Okay, so I put the Tea Dua on top and I blended it in. Um, what I noticed before I keep going, um, when like putting dipping the brush into the eyeshadow, it does flake a lot. I don't know if you could see the flake, but it does flake a lot. But that. As of now, that's the only um, issue that I'm having with it. So now I'm going to go in with the champagne right here. And I'm just going to add it on the lid. So I am feeling this palette so far. So, um, the last color that I have left to use is the Rich. And I'm just going to put that under. 30 hertz straight up. So here is the look so far. Well, the eye look. Um, it's actually, it came out good. Um. I'm not usually an eyeshadow under the eyelid type of person, but um, I think it um, added a good look to it. So now I'm going to try to use the blush, and the blush is called Alea. So the blush is very light, um, not some not a color that I would use for my skin tone because to see, to get the most out of it, I have to put a lot, and I didn't really put a lot, so I can't really see it as much, but well, I can't really see it as much, like if I look in the mirror, um, maybe you can, maybe after I look at this video, I probably will, but um, yeah, it's very light, so I'm going to go over that with the highlighter, and the highlighter is called Freshly Picked. Alright, 
so I put on the highlighter. Um, it's not bad. It glow. I, I do see the glow, but it's not. It's not my. You know, my go-to for a highlighter. It wouldn't be my go-to. Sorry. <laughs> it wouldn't be my go-to for a highlighter. So now I'm going to try the lip color. Uh, the lip color is called Kiss Me. So this is how it looks. It looks like a, like one of those lip pencils. Before I do that, I'm going to line my lips with Juvia's Place um, Cola Lip Liner. I don't usually use lip pencils like this so we'll see how this works out so I'm not feeling this the lip um, color it's very pale um, if I were to use it I'd probably have to line it with a um, darker lip liner but like I wouldn't wear it by itself I probably wouldn't really wear this at all but um yeah you as you can see like you don't really see it because it's very pale and they also sent a perfume so this is the perfume and i'm just gonna put it on a sample and just smell and let you guys know how it smells So I don't like the smell. <laughs> um, not something I would wear to go out. This is honestly, yeah, this is more like an older person smell. So not something that I would wear. Okay, so today I tried for you the Rosé All Day by the Xterra Glam Collection from Physicians Formula that I got from Influencer. And out of this palette, um, I do like the eyeshadows, so that's something I definitely use, except the flakiness, I don't enjoy that. But I would definitely use the eyeshadows. I'm not really feeling the blush or the highlighter for me personally. Um, the lip color, I'd have to wear, like I said, I had to wear like a darker lip liner. And the perfume, I do not like. So, that is my review of this. Um, and... They do have the palette by itself. They have more colors in the palette. So, I mean, the eyeshadow palette. So, if you definitely want to get that, I would suggest that. Um, maybe the blush and the highlighter would look better on you than it does on me. But I'm just not feeling it. So, that would be my take on it. Um, but, yeah. So, um, like I said, I definitely recommend Influencer. Especially if you are a small YouTuber and you're trying to grow your channel. You're just trying to grow your Instagram. It's like to get products to review, like I said, they're complimentary. So you don't really have to pay for anything. You may have to pay for shipping, but that's about it. So, But I do recommend it to get exposure to different products and to try and just get your voice out also. So definitely download it. Um, give it a try. Um, if you have any questions about this product, let me know and I'll try to answer it to the best of my abilities. And I will see you next time.